What's going on everybody? My name is Jeans, bringing you guys more ranked double battles for Pokemon Sword and Shield. In today's video, we're rocking out with this Siftree team right here, which I am actually hyped to use because Siftree is one of my favorite grass type Pokemons in all of Pokemon. Also rocking out on this team is this Senescorch here, which is hype. I do not know if he's a G-Max form yet. I do not know. This is my first time going in with this team. Didn't even practice with them. We're just getting straight into the action. But guys, if you want to catch more content from me or just support the channel, make sure you smash that like button on this video and click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. Seriously, we are pushing 1,000 subs. I cannot thank you guys enough. Rocking in that front spot right here, we have that Torkoal, who is going to be huge for this team, considering he has that drought as its ability, and this team thrives under the heat. The heat is our friend here. He's rocking Eruption, Heat Wave, Solar Beam, and Iron Defense. Then we have this Vileplume over here with that Black Sludge as its item to, to recover a little bit of health action. We got Solar Beam, Growth, Moon Blast, and Drain Punch to even get some more health back during battle. Then we have this Sip Tree, who we're going to be using a lot. I want to show them off here with Synthesis, Growth, Leaf Storm, and Extra Sensory. Let me know in the comment section down below, does Synthesis give me more health in the drought? I'm not too sure. I think it does, but I would love to get you guys feedback on that one. Then we have this Cherum, who changes forms in the sun, in the drought, whichever you want to call it, with Petal Dance, Leech Seed, Solar Beam, and Growth with that Focus Sash so it cannot get one tapped up. Then we have this Whimsicott right here, who is a great Pokemon for doubles with that Tailwind, Dazzling Gleam to hit both, Sunny Day to get that drought going once again, or to start it up, and switch to switch items. We have Eject Button on it, so like, say we don't like the opponent's Pokemon, we kind of just switch through that and say get out of here full and switch him out for that turn and then we already talked about that center scorch but his move set is scald flamethrower leech life and coil he's rocking that life orb to do some extra damage but guys if you want to use this team for yourself front the code is at the bottom of the screen try it out let me know how you do with it i would love to hear your guys feedback and let me know for question of the day who is your favorite grass type pokemon i already talked about sift tree but one pokemon above him is skeptile skeptile is my favorite pokemon of all time hands down i love it so much but guys, without further ado, let's get rolling out with this Drought slash Grass Team. Battle number one coming at you guys, and what a surprise, another Trick Room team, guys. <laughs> We're not going to be bringing in our Whimsicott because the Tailwind's not really going to work too much once he gets his uh, Tailwind set up. So how are we going to rock out with this? How are we going to do this? Who are we going to lead? I kind of want to bring in a Torkoal a little bit. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Definitely that uh, Shift Tree and that Sun Scorch, but probably in the back end. I kind of want to lead that charm. Potentially get a Leech Seed set up. Then do we go Vileplume? Let me see the Vileplume's move set before we go in here. Dude, I need a way to set up the drought, though. I kind of need a way to set up this drought. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Drain Punch, Moon Blast. That does work out pretty well. Let's go. Let's take out this charm here. Let's go Vileplume, Torkoal in the front spot. Shift Tree and Sense Scorch in the back end. We have Life Orb. I maybe should have just went off with my uh, Sense Scorch right off the bat. And maybe Dynamax. Because he is life for it. He can do some damage. He can do some damage here. But guys, if you want to catch more content from me, head to the link in the description below. Jeans25 on Twitch. We stream four plus days every single week. Come hang out with me. It's tons of fun. I would love to see you guys there. And if you haven't checked out my last video with that Malamar, oh my god, get over there and check that out. We dominated with that Malamar. He is like so OP with the squad. Like, honestly, he rips up. He rips up. But we go Vileplume Torkoal right off the bat, which is huge. Like, you can run a Trick Room. We'll be chilling. We have the Drought. We can go into the Solar Beam right off the bat. But I'm going to start off with an, with an Eruption here. I think Eruption is the play calling. He's going to Frisk us here. Nobody has to follow me. Nobody has to follow me. It's fine. We can go into the... We can go into the Drain Punch. Or the Solar Beam. What do we want to do here? I kind of want to go here. I kind of want to go here. And then into a Heat Wave. That should get some burns. That should get a burn on that Dusk I feel like the one Solar Beam will take out this right here. Might go for Protect. Might go for Protect and then into the Trick Room. Let's see. Ally Switch. That's fine. That's fine. He goes for an Ally Switch. He's still gonna... Well, we might go last here. The Vile Plume's gonna get off a nice little Solar Beam here. We're gonna get this Heat Wave off. Do a little bit of damage. Potentially get some burns. Solar Beam pops. Get him. Get him. But we're just trying to not let him get his Trick Room. But look how much, dude. That thing just soaks up damage with his Evo Light. With his evil light, like, jeez, man. Show me a burn on something. Show me some burns, a little bit of burns. We get one on the right period, which would be Show me two. No, that'll be awesome. That'll be awesome. High horsepower comes in. We eat. We eat all day. Show me that defensive. Man. That's some defensive love in there. Um, we're gonna take out one of them. We're double solar beaming into this this crowd here. Like, you want to ally switch? That's fine by me. We're coming both ends of the game here. We're coming both ends of the game here. <laughs> so you can do what you want. We're coming both ends. Go ahead. Go for another ally switch. I dare you. I dare you, man. But I'm hoping to get one win with this team because this team is tough. It is tough. Like, just looking at it, it's like fire counters it. 
and flying counters it. So it's like, if we get one win, that'd be huge, especially in ranked Master Ball battles. Like, jeez, man. Jeez, where all you see is this. The same thing every time. Like, I hope this dude goes for another ally switch just to waste for a turn. Like, we're doubling into you, buddy. Like, you're dead either way. Your Rhyperior is gone. I want that thing out the way. Solar Beam comes through. We absorb in light. We're gonna do some work. So we're doubling into you. Solar Beam. Yeah, yee, baby. Yeah, yee. We'll be hitting on this one. The Dust Clops. Just a little bit of damage. Show me a crit. Nope, no crit. But still, and now the Tourcoal's going. Oh, yes, sir. We're coming in hot here. What you want? We're doubling. You, your ally switch means nothing to me. It means nothing. Say bye to your Rhyperior. See you later, buddy. Yee. <laughs> Hey, okay, he's gone. This Dust Cops is here. Probably gonna get that Trick Room set up, which could work in our favor. Okay, so Trick Room's here. Trick Room is here. Depends who he goes out into. I can see him going for a, a, a Memento before he goes out here. I'm lowering one of my Pokemon stats here. That's fine. That is fine. We're chilling. We're chilling. The Vile Plume is chilling there. Look at his little dance, bouncing his little head up and down. I'd like to see it. Oh my lord, that thing looks gorgeous. Shiny Delmize? Like, ooh -wee. Looking pretty. Uh, we could go for a. We go for a growth. So we do go for a growth here. We we'll go for a heat wave. We we'll go for a heat wave here. Let's go for a heat wave. I see him doubling into my boys. My Torkoal, my little turtle mon. My turtle Pokemon. Is he gonna dine it? He is going to dine it. He's Dynamaxing that Delmize here. Which is rather scary. Rather scary. Hopefully he goes after my Vileplume. In all honesty, I wanna get this heat wave off. I really do want to get this heat wave off. It could be huge. It could be dangerous. I do have my set switch in the back end, but I could see this thing rocking a water move. Not even a lie. Let's see what he does. Let's see what you do, buddy. He's gonna go first with the ally switch. That's fine. We have heat wave coming in. We have heat wave coming in, and we're growing. So your ally switch was a waste. And the geyser does come in here. And can we eat with that drought? With that drought, can we eat you? Torkoal, show it to me. I love you, Torkoal. I love you, Torkoal. Um, I kind of want to swap out with my, uh, I kind of want to swap out with my Torkoal so we can switch the rain up after this. I think it's Life Orb. We're going to go for a Heat Wave here. Do a little bit of damage. Can you show me some burns? Burn on Delmai? Something like that? Nothing. Growth comes out. I am going to swap out the Torkoal here. I'm going to swap the Torkoal. Go into the, uh, the Shift Tree. And then roll from there. So, Vile Plume's going to go for that. We have the Growth going. We raise our attack and Special Attack. We can go for a Moon Blast now. That should take out this thing. Gonna go after you, and then we're gonna swap out just to just to get that drought out again. Like just to get that drought out again. If you want to go for another max geyser, that's fine by me. My uh, I will eat that up, and then we can swap back in there when everything's done and get the drought going again. So shift tree's popping here. What's up, shift tree? How you doing, buddy? Willow Wisp comes through. Oh my vile plume, leave me alone, please. That's not nice. It's raining. The burn should just go away. Like it heals it, so it just soothes the burn. But that's not how it works. Max geyser comes out again. Huge. Nice little switch from us there. I can see him potentially going into... Yeah, wow, that did a lot more damage than I thought it would. Like, a lot, lot more damage than I thought it would. Moon Blast comes through. Do some work on that. Dust Cop, take him out. Take him out, please. Yep, Dust Cop's gone. He's, he's out of here. He's out of here. Uh, do I guard up? How many turns left in Trick Room? I want to keep my Shift Tree alive, not even going to lie. How many turns left in Trick Room? We might just have to say, Shift Tree, you're going down here. Show him off in the next battle. But he's just here to kind of block up some shots. That would love... Ooh. Do I really want that drought out here? <laughs> that is some tough news. That's tough. Let's see how many turns left in Trick Room. Two. Two. That is rather scary. We go for a Moon Blast. Oh my god, he's doubling into me. He's doubling into me. We go for a Moon Blast on you. If I can get the heal, we're going to go for it. If I can go for here, we can go over on you. Potentially get a flinch, but I think we're dead. I think both these Pokemon are gone. I think it's going to go. Actually, my Vile Plume might be able to survive. In all honesty, my Vile Plume might be able to survive here. It's actually, probably not now because the Seal Spike's coming in. Eee! Wow! Delmize coming in hot. Delmize is coming in hot. The Trick Room just rolls out so strong. It honestly just rolls out too strong. Let's see. Oh, Vile Plume sits on his bomb. He says, no! Hey, dude, that Delmize is rocking out here. Heat Wave's going to come through, through and take us out. Tough news. We're popping out with the Scent of Scourge and the Torkoal now. Get out there, buddy. We're going to set the Drought. And the thing is, is my Torkoal slower than that uh, Delmize? That could be huge. That could be huge. And we can Dynamax our boy. We can Dynamax our boy here. Oh, yes. Oh, we're sitting. We're not sitting terrible here. We're not sitting terrible. 
As we still have our boy, we're going to Dynamax now into you and go into the Max Flare over on you. And then we're going to go into uh, Heat Wave or Eruption. Let's go, let's go Eruption. It'll probably do a little bit more to that, uh, that Shen Lore because it's Max HP. They we're chilling, but dude, his Shinies look awesome. His Shinies look dope. Let's see, here we go. We're rocking out here. One more turn in that Trick Room to end, right? Like one more and then we're, we're chilling. Like no more Trick Room for him because the Dust Cops is gone. The Collapse of the Dust is gone and the Rhyperior is gone. It's down to a little 2v2 action here. It's down to a little 2v2. Can we get this victory? Can we get this victory? And Scorch comes out. Like I said, we just have to wither out this thing. When Liquidation comes here, we eat. We eat up all day, baby. There you go, Life Orb pops, and Chandler's gonna go, or Torkoal goes beforehand. Oh, that thing's Flash Fire, you little bugger. Little bugger. But we're gonna do some damage over on you. Yay. Get it. Do some damage there. We're gonna take out that Thelmise here. Bring it out to a little 2v1 situation. We're Flash Fire too. What you want, fool? Thank you for powering up our moves. Can my Torkoal eat? Oh, Torkoal does not eat. Okay, Torkoal does not eat. He gets a crit! What you mean? Okay, so it's down to 1v1. We do have Max Geyser. We do have Max Geyser, not gonna lie. I don't know if I should go into the Max Geyser. Could be good. But there we go. Take him out. Beautiful. The Flash Fire comes in clutch. It comes in clutch. And now we're sitting with a 1v1 situation, and we are Dynamax. We are Dynamax. And we go first now. And we go first. Lovely. 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 You love to see it, guys. All right, let's hop here. Let's go into... Do I want to go... No, we have to go into the Geyser here. We have to go into the Geyser. We're gonna go into the Geyser. We're gonna change the weather up once again. Just tough news. What is he gonna go into? That's my question. Hopefully he goes to do a fire move. I honestly hope he does. Because now we'll do less damage in the rain. We got the rain going. Built. If we like if we survive this hit, that's gonna be game. It's gonna be game. This uh Max Geyser in the rain should do some work. Ten score is gonna come up clutch here. We didn't get to really show off this shift tree, but that's chilling. Hold the phone. Okay, okay, we're chilling, we're chilling. <laughs> I was gonna say, hold the phone. This thing gets like a crit and takes me out. I'm gonna be so mad. I'm gonna be so mad. But the shift tree did come in there and actually clutch it up for us. Make us get that drought back out there and wait out this match a little bit longer for the win. So that was cool, but I want to show off that shift tree doing some work on the battlefield, which we will do in the next battle. Let's get it. There's the game. Let's go. I'm, I'm done. I'm done. This video is complete. I don't care if we lose the next match or anything. This video is done. We did it. Wipe my hands off. We got to win with this squad. Let's go. Ooh-wee, we got that win, baby. We got that win with this team right here. It is tough. It is tough. Like, that was a tough match for me to play. But we're hopping into battle number two. Can we get another one? That'd be pretty nuts. That'd be pretty nuts. I hope so. I hope so. But he has this Sableye team right here. Not a Trick Room team. It doesn't look like a Trick Room team. I see him leading that Sableye. Maybe that, uh, maybe that Scrafty going for a little bit of a fake out action. I could totally potentially see that. Um, we are going to go with the Whimsicott. We're going to go with the Whimsicott Charm action. Uh, we're not going to be bringing in that Torkoal, and then we're going to go, uh, whoa, 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 what did I just do? Okay, I hit somebody. I was like, what do you mean? We're going to go Shift Tree, and then do we go Scent Scorch here? Where do we go Vileplume? That is the call. That is the tough call, because the Black Sludge comes up clutch. Um, Scent Scorch can do some work. He can do some work. We're going to go in, in with the Scent Scorch here. Show him off once again, but hopefully our Shift Tree can shine this battle. That would be huge. That would be huge. We have our, uh, Psychic move. And we have our grass move, Leaf Storm, which does work. If we can set off some growths and all that. And we also have that Charm here. Charm in the sun rocks out. He rocks out. Brings up Flower Gift as his ability. Boosts our attack and our special defense for all allied Pokemon out on the field. It was just what he does. It's just his little bit of Flower Gift. And he turns adorable. He turns into a lovely little Pokey. Lovely little Pokey. But let's go. Let's get this win. Can we go two? I don't know. It's going to be tough. This team is tough to play like i like once i looked at this team i was like this is gonna be tough to play and that first battle that was tough to play but we ended up getting that win sableye in the rotom pop sableye and rotom get the lead and our whimsicott and charm get the get the next thing i can see him potentially going for a fake out here totally see him going for a fake out with the sableye let's see let's go into our tailwind we can go for dazzle beam or hmm, no we're gonna go tailwind first and into a leech seed over on the i want to set up a leech seed no bad or I can't go for a growth. Let's set up a lead seed first. Rotom or let's go save by. Let's just let's just do the save by here. He does not Dynamax. I was gonna say I don't see him Dynamaxing here. All in all honesty. Let's go. Trick comes out here. What are you giving us? Don't you dare give it to my Charm. Give it to my Whimscott. That'd be hilarious. Charm. Oh, you gave me the lagging tail and you get my Focus Ash. It's okay. Your Focus Ash is gone. You little hunk of junk. You little hunk of junk. Light screen comes up from him. That is uh, honestly fine by me. 
That's honestly fine by me. Free turn. We get that Tailwind off, and we're going to just start chipping away with its leashy. We're going to go into a Growth next turn. We're going to go Growth and into a Sunny Day. Sunny Day into my Growth. A Growth. We're going to boost our attack stats, which is lovely, which is lovely. And the Sunny Day is going to pull out the Flower Gift ability. It's going to pull out the Flower Gift. And we're going to turn into an adorable little flower. This thing is absolutely adorable. Save my Protects. That's fine by me, man. That's fine by me. What are you going to go into? What is that uh, Rotom going to do? What is that Rotom going to do? Well, the Sunny Day pops. This is why we did not bring the Torkoal, because we can just run it with the Whimsicott. Like so. Like so. Flower Gift. Mwah. Turn into pretty little flower. Look at him. Look how happy. Look how happy he is. Old Switch comes in here. Oh, my Whimsicott. That's fine. We eat up all day. Who are you going to go into from here? Look how happy this thing is. Our Jack Button pops out. Who do I think he's going to go into? Who do I think he's going to go into? That's the question. We got Shift Tree? Here we go Scorching. We're in the drought. We might as well go Scorch. Who do I see him going into? Is the real question. It's the real question. Who do I see him going into? So we had that Drought on. He has a Scrafty. Um, do we get Shift Tree? I see we get Shift Tree here. Let's go Shift Tree. Shift Tree coming in hot. You're coming in hot. I might just Dynamax his Shift Tree. Depends what he goes into with the Volt Switch. Wait, does that Volt Switch work if we go with Jack Button? That's my question. Did it not work? Did my eject button just cancel that thing out? Hold the phone. Hold the phone. i never seen this before. It does. That's lovely. Let me check out this Pokemon before we actually Dynamax. Here's the Raladon. Mm, 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 mm. I don't think we should Dynamax. In all honesty, I say we just go for a growth. He wants to switch out. He wants to switch out. Can we double growth here? Can we double Lychee? I'm going for it. I'm seeing if we could double Lychee. That'd be huge. That would be huge if we can. I'm not too sure. I am not too sure, guys, but I hope he can. I hope he can. That would be hilarious. Just help, 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 help from all different ways. You have that flower gift up. You gonna Volt Switch again? I can totally see me the hard swapping or Volt Switch again. But I've never seen that, that the eject button kind of like cancels out the Volt Switch. That is hilarious. That is hilarious. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. The flower gift is running. Our special defense is high up in the field. Shift Tree gets the growth off. Yes, sir. Let's get it, buddy. Let's get rolling here. I don't really see that Sableye doing much. The will o -Wisp, Oh, he's popping off with the will o -Wisp. Please show me that we can get this. This will be hilarious. Please show me that we can double Leech Seed. And the Nightshade comes across on my Cherim. Wait, my Cherim. I take a little bit of damage. Show me that we can double Leech Seed. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. No, it doesn't affect him. I don't know if we could or not. Let me know in the comment section down below. Can we do that? That would be hilarious. That would be hilarious. And we're going to start doing some work. We're going to start doing some work. Do we go for the flinch or do we Dyna? I am going to Dyna. And we can set up a terrain, right? We could set up a psychic terrain. This is exactly what we're going to do. We're going to set up a psychic terrain. That doesn't happen again. And then do we just growth again? Growth again? Bring a solar beam. Run a solar beam on the Sableye. Let's get it. He's going to withdraw the Rotom. Who are you going into? No burns on my thing. The Garanus comes out here. Nice little call from us. No terrain coming out here. No terrain. Na, da, da. Do I go for it? Like, do I go for the double leech Like, I want it so bad, all honesty. In all honesty, I really want it. But hopefully, I, hopefully my shift tree will outspeed that Gyarados, and we can bring him down to, like, at least half, or a little bit below, and then, uh, stab Max Overgrowth can take him out. Let's see it. Get it, buddy. Wish our Tailwind was still running. Do, 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 do. Sableye's gonna protect. That's fine. Should've just went for it. We should've just went for the double. <laughs> Knowing that he was possibly gonna switch out. He got some max mind storm. Yeet ski. Do some damage. Oh my god, the stab max overgrowth could definitely take it out. We are grossed up too, which is nice. Which is nice. But we have this terrain out. We have this lovely little terrain that overgrowth should be able to do some work here. So give me that. Give me that uh leech seed health too. We need a little bit of leech seed to neglect that burn. I gotta test it out. Like, I totally gotta test out if my charm's gonna do some work here. With the, with the double lychee. Like, like, I really want to go into it. I gotta see how many uh, turns are left in the Tailwind. It, yep, it's, it's gone. Never mind. Okay, so Tailwind's gone. Max Overgrowth's gonna pop here. And we're gonna go for the double lychee. Like, hands down, I'm going for this double lychee. Like, you're not gonna let me not go for it. You gotta be able to do it. He's gonna withdraw the Sableye. That's fine. What are you gonna go into? The Duraludon comes out here. Is he Dynamaxing the Gyarados? That's the real question. Show me that we can double lychee. He is Dynamaxing the Gyarados here. Can we take him out? Can we take him out? Maybe we should we should have just doubled into him. He's probably going for a what's it called? He's probably gonna go for a max guard. Play it smart.
play it like a smart little cookie here. It's fine. Shift Tree's doing some work. Shift Tree is doing some work. Show me that we can double leech. He's not going for the guard. Here comes the overgrowth. Come on, stab. Take him out. Do some work. Do some saucy work. Do it. Oh, so close. So close. He might take us out here with a max airstream. Now, please show me that we can double leech you. Show it to me, baby. Show it to me. You're gonna go for the airstream. On who? Not, not my Cherum. My shift tree. Oh my lord, that just dumped him. That just dumped him. We were doing work with the shift tree too. He's gonna boost the speed. Now this turn can be a waste or it can be something wonderful. Could be a waste or it could be something wonderful. We have this drought out here, so I can totally see us eating up a max uh geyser. And my sense scorch comes out here. Moxie Gyarados, oh no. Oh no, that's scary. Show us that we can do this. Lead seed. Is this double? Did we get two? Did we get two health lines here? Three health lines, actually? Hold the phone. There's one from the Gyarados, right? That one from the Gyarados? Now show me the one from the Duraldon. I think we can only have one out on the field. That's a bad news. Yeah, I think it's only one out on the field. Light screen wears off from them. Uh, do we go into the Wimscot here? Um, I know my Wimscot's gonna outspeed. It's gonna outspeed. I said we get up this tailwind first. First and foremost, tailwind's gotta pop here. Get this tailwind up. We go for a solar beam. We go for a solar beam on this Gyarados. Try to take him out. I wonder what that Duraldon's gonna do. I see that Gyarados potentially coming after me. Hopefully my tailwind goes first, and then we can outspeed with the Cherim and take out that Gyarados. That could be huge. That could be huge. Here we go. Tailwind pops. Wonderful. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Come on, Cherim. Come on, big buddy. Come on, big Cherum, go first. Oh, no, Cherum. <laughs> Not the Cherum. Okay, he goes after the Whimsicott. That is fine. That is honestly fine. You can go after that Whimsicott. That is all I wanted you to do, Whimsicott. That is all I wanted you to do. Let's get that tailwind off. And you did your job. Lovely, Whimsicott. Lovely. Okay. Okay, now we're chilling. The Moxie comes out here. A little, a little bit of Moxie action. And Cherum goes. No, Cherum does not go. Snarl comes out here. That's fine. This is going to drop our special... Attack, but we boosted with the growth, and I still see it taking out this uh, this uh, little uh, Gyarados here. Get it, take it down, take it down. Solar Beam, now you take it down. Woo wee, Cherum, not the Cherum, the Cherum coming up big. Okay, 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 so now we're sitting here. Right, my set scorch comes out here, the sunlight does fade, the sunlight does fade off, and we do not. The flower gift's gone. No, not the flower gift. I loved it so much. Now we have ugly charm. Now we have ugly charm. Ooh, that's a little rough. It's a little bad news. A little bears. It's a little bit of bears. Bad news bears. Okay. Scorchy Poo's coming in here. We have the lagging tail, so it stinks. We're so slow. That's why That's why the charm's slow. Forgot about the lagging tail. And the Sableye comes out here. I've actually seen a quash or a burn here. Let's see, maybe a protect. Uh, what do we go for here? Hmm. We we'll go for a leech life. It's not very effective on you. Flames are it's effective. We gotta get this Duraldon out of here. I'm gonna set up this leech seed on this Duraldon. I'm gonna start sucking the life out of it. The Quash's gonna come over on my Santa Scorch. On my Scorchy Poo. Which is fine. That's that's totally fine. The Breaking Swipe's gonna come through. Oh! Mwah! He's gonna drop our attack here. That's his plan. Dropping our attack? What's this dude's problem? Like, what's this dude's problem? Alright, Flames are. We're gonna get the. Burn on him, and we're gonna have the lead seed. We're gonna double into this point. Give me that lead seed. Charm's chilling here. He's going here for the long run. He's going here for the long run. Show me the burn. Show me the burn. We'll double in the fool. Show me the burn. Get it. No, no burn. Unless the burn comes afterwards. Nope, no burn. We get a little bit of health, and now we get a little bit of lead seed action. Breaking swipe is tough. I'm not worried about that save by too much. He's just gonna quash us all day when his Duraldon already outspeeds us. So, like, he can go for that. That's totally fine by me. Here goes my leech seed. Yes, sir. Give me that leech seed. And I might just go into a pedal dance. Do I pedal dance up on this fool? Or do I growth it up? I might just start growthing up. I don't know, dude. That's a tough, that's a tough little biscuit call. I don't want to pedal dance and just double into this fool. That's exactly what we're going to do. Pedal dance. I mean, it's not very effective. But we can pedal dance. Pedal dance is huge. Hmm. Hmm. God. Oh, my lord. Oh, my god. We're going to pedal dance here. Wait, we have to use it on ourselves? Hold up, hold the phone. The user attacks the target by scattering pe petals for two to three turns. The user then becomes confused. So why is it going on myself? Hmm. Might as well try it out. Wait, might as well try it out. Let's see. Do I hit myself? <laughs> He's gonna quash my boy again. Like, you are already outspeeding him. 
We were already outspeeding him. It's fine. The Quash doesn't really matter. Draco Meteor pops out here. And the special attack is going to lower. This might take me out, though. This is a little scary. Ooh, Sun Scorch does survive. You beautiful little monster. You beautiful little monster. I'm going to go for the Petal Dance. Get it! Petal Dance on him. Okay, this is just... Oh, my damage. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This is just attack at random. The Flamethrower pops here. Let's go. Let's go. We're still here. Charm here to play. No, Set the Scorch goes down. Oh my god, if we could have survived one more turn, that would have been huge. They have this Petal Dance rocking out here, and that Leech Seed is doing work. I'd rather, what's it called? I'd rather the Petal Dance slide over to the left Pokemon. He has two more Pokemon left, and we're Leech Seed up here. Cherum coming in clutch? Question mark, question mark. <laughs> let's go, let's get it, Cherum. Cherum, I need you here. Look at that health. Burns nothing for you, buddy. The burns nothing for you. Now, who's his final Pokemon? Who is his final Pokemon? Because we took out the Gyarados, we took out the Sableye, it's the Roudon, it's the Rotom, I forgot about it. This is not looking good for us, guys. Unless we get a monster crit here. Unless we get a monster crit. Well, let's go. Petal Dance gonna come off here. They're gonna both go first. They're both gonna go first here. Home for that Clutch Charm. That's not gonna do too, too much. The special attack is down here. Three minutes left in the battle. He's gonna drop us. Ooh! That actually did a heaping amount. I thought it was gonna be way less than that. Ooh, scary, scary. Bolt Switch comes out here. We should be able to eat that up. Yeah, we do eat that up. He got this Rotom in one hit or something. Hell Dance comes out. Who are we hitting up? Dude, that did some damage. Dang, man, for not very effective hit. But no, that is going to be the game. We go one and one with this squad. Because that was a long game. I thought maybe our charm could pull it out, but we are confused now. That is tough. I'm not going to run. I'm just going to chill here. Take this one to the chin. It's okay. We went one and one. Like I said, if I got one win with this team, we would be chilling because this team is very, very hard to play with. They're very hard to play with. Once I saw this team, I was like, dude, I know it's going to be hard because so much just counters it. And it's kind of just like a one-type team. It's tough. It's tough. And there's not that many uh, coverage on it. Not too much coverage. Our turn does peter out. And the grass goes. Grass is gone. Not the grass. Not the grass. And we're just going to rock out with a, a little bit of growth action here. We're going to grow up. We're going to grow up. We're going to grow from this battle and move on with our life. Strike meter pops here. Uh, does this one take us out? Yeah, probably. You know, he's like minus four on the special attack board. Yep, it still takes us out. GG to this guy. GG to this guy. We got one and one. Fun team, actually. Very fun team. The Charon was tons of fun. I love switching forms with that and all that. Using the Sift Tree and Send to Scorch. This team was definitely very, very fun to play, but definitely not a team I wouldn't bring on the rank ladder if I was really trying to push hard. But it was definitely fun to see how it did using such an off meta team. But we went one and one with it. Like I said, we got that one win. I'm hyped for it. That is dope. And the Cherim was so much fun to play. The Cherim, the Shift Tree was fun. Same thing, like all these Pokemon were very fun to play, but it was cool to kind of like use a different team so off the meta, like I usually do. But this team was like, you guys could tell it was just way off than normal. But guys, if you like to use this team for yourself, the right code is at the bottom screen. If you do end up using it, let me know how you do with it. Also, let me know for question of the day, who is your favorite grass type? But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.